Hi friends, today we are going to talk about one very important thing that has changed. Okay, in S4 HANA. You remember when we, you when you started your SAP career in the ECC or 4.6 or 4.7 version? Okay, and you used to go to this transaction S11 and we used to know that there is a transaction called BSEC. There is a table called BSEC. If I go here BSEC and if I display this table can has all the data but it cannot be used because there was something called it was a pool table okay now if you see there is no pool table it's no more and there's nothing pool table in s400 so what does that mean really so it means so suppose if i want to do a query sqvi okay simple about query you can create to sq01 or whatever so i'll just try to do a query i'll see z get i'll try to get the uh, invoices that are blocked okay as well as the vendor number okay the vendor name okay so what i'll do is z get block okay so here i click on this and let's click create and I'll just put get invoice block okay now here I'll just click table join okay and here I'll click enter and then I will just do BSEC okay and here the next joining would be the proposal that they want okay so I think that's it I have it before in SAP EC6 you cannot do that it's not possible so this is what I did now what I'm going to do is I want to find the blocked entries, right? So what I'll do, I'll just need to convert it into technical names because I'm habituated with that. I'll try to get all these things, and I don't care about care about the the I need the money, DMBTR, okay? I probably the tax code, uh, and for sure I know the the block CLSPR. here be sick and it's the block uh, payment block is yeah payment block so I'll go here and uh, the next thing is I will pick I'll go in the vendor side and I'll go to, I'll take name one okay and I'll put suppose the lift now land and Thing. just this okay and I'll click on this and I have it ready now here what I'll be doing is I'll put company code probably the year uh, I'll bring it here and what I'll do is I'll put the block okay. here block payment block simple, very simple and you click on save and we click enter And we execute once we have executed now I'll try to put a block I'll say anything which is blocked so I'll select not equal to and for this company I don't want I'll just make it for everything I don't have anything so I'll make it start I hope there will be some blocks uh, okay here I have to put a number to the one four to twenty twenty and I'll select execute and here I have a block so if you see this is the payment block A okay. so that was for one company so luckily we had one block okay so so here you see you so we created so this is one big advantage where you know we we got BSEC that can be read it's a transparent table it's no more a pool table and that helps you a lot so that's very important. Uh, so that's it for today's tutorial. BSEC can be used to 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 be used in your program, in your ABAP program as well as ABAP query. So no more those days where you cannot use it. Uh, so stay tuned to my channel and happy SAP learning.